just hear that voice and you, and you fall in love. That's great. There's a little Marilyn Monroe Smurfette action thing going on in New York that's very sweet. Whoa, is there grabs in here? It's really interesting because I get to kind of be a part of creating her character and adding little nuances to who I guess she is on the big screen. Let's stay Smurfistic. You know what? I choose to be Pessa We're all gonna die. When we were deciding which six Smurfs were gonna come through the portal, we knew we had to have Grouchy because they're, you just gotta have that naysayer voice. Sing, stop! None of you find that song just the tiniest bit annoying. I find it annoying. I'm not sure how the how this voice became the the hit machine. You start out as a dog, you end up as a cat, you go to be a toucan, and then you go to become the biggest thing of all, which is you're blue and you're a Smurf. And the grouchy one, which is perfect. Very little act. I had no coffee. I have a daughter that, you know, I just, you know, she's 15. That will keep you um, grouchy. The funny thing was to see the way they had drawn him, and it kind of looked like me. And his arms crossed, and I said, oh, wow, that's the eyebrows down. That has a bluish resemblance to, to, to my normal look. What can I say, clumsy? 